how to get off this train. Bullet Train is the latest action-packed thriller from Deadpool 2 director David Leitch and adapted from the book by Katara Saka. Brad Pitt stars as Ladybug, an unlucky assassin who's determined to execute his latest mission peacefully, but his objective quickly puts him in the path of deadly adversaries from around the world. To get you up to speed, here are five things to know before you watch Bullet Train. After too many missions that went sideways, assassin Ladybug has vowed to complete his latest objective as peacefully as possible. Believing himself to be unlucky, this latest mission provides an opportunity to set himself on the right path. Tasked with boarding the titular bullet train and stealing a briefcase, what at first appears to be a simple snatch and grab turns into a high speed fight for survival as Ladybug and a train full of the world's deadliest killers hurls through Japan. Brought together by fate, everyone has their motive and storylines crisscross like a railway junction as they fight to make it to the end of the line alive. On board this high-speed comedic thriller is a cast of colourful characters. Brad Pitt is the bucket hat-wearing assassin Ladybug looking to turn over a new leaf. Tangerine, played by one Aaron Taylor Johnson, is one half of the deadly assassin duo known as the Twins. His brother-in-arms, Lemon, is portrayed by Brian Terry Henry. Joy King plays the Prince, a young woman whose cold-blooded attitude stands in stark contrast to her appearance, a contrast that she uses to take full advantage of. Andrew Koji is Kimura, a low-level Tokyo criminal who is out to exact his revenge on the person who attacked his son. The Hornet is an assassin and master of disguise played by Zassi Beats. And rapper Bad Bunny plays the Wolf, another assassin with a vendetta against Ladybug. Director David Leitch knows a thing or two about stunts, seeing as he's an experienced stuntman, stunt coordinator, fight choreographer, and Brad Pitt's former stunt double. He brings all his knowledge to create energetic action sequences based out of story and character in Bullet Train. Working closely with stunt coordinator Greg Rementer, the pair knew the confines of shooting of the train would prove a challenge. Speaking about the process, Rementer said, A lack of space can be unforgiving, and we didn't have it to hide stunt doubles. So many of our actors, maybe more than any film, we've done before did a lot of their own action, starting from the top with Brad. To match the colourful and diverse characters, Bullet Train's Japan was created to be equally heightened and stylized while still being respectful of its culture. Due to filming restrictions, one key challenge to creating this vision of Japan was the inability to shoot on real moving bullet trains or even train stations. And with the train itself actually being two train cars constructed on a soundstage, how do you bring Japan to life? The solution was to use LED walls surrounding the train cars that displayed footage of the Japanese landscape that was captured by specialized cameras en route along Japan's freeways, and then sped up to match the train's blistering speed of 250 miles an hour. Attention to detail was crucial to creating a stylized imaginary vision of Japan, and that extended to the costume design for each of the main characters. Their big personalities required costumes that felt uniquely tailored for them and reflected their background. For Ladybug, costume designer Sarah Evelyn worked with Pitt to create a completely custom-made ensemble that reflected the character's position as a disheveled, reluctant assassin and reticent hero. For assassin duo Lemon and Tangerine, Evelyn subverts expectations by ditching the cliché hit men in dark suits and to dress tangerine in a Savile Row three-piece suit, complete with pinky ring, pocket square and brass knuckles, and a double denim look, also known as the Canadian tuxedo for Lemon to reflect his British working-class roots. This is our final stop. Have your tickets ready to go see Bullet Train out in cinemas on 3rd of August. For more on the film, stick with IGN.